Hello and welcome to watching this video. In this video, I want to show you how you can create honey in Real Fellow and 3ds Max and After Effects. Okay, um, as you can see, I want to teach you how you can create honey like this. This honey project is um, useful for beginner. Because if you want to create real honey, you should apply many details and in future I will create another tutorial and I will teach you how you can create real honey in real fellow 3ds Max and After Effects. Okay. Um, as you can see, I was create sample in real fellow after that. Um, simulate that and import that in 3ds max after that I render that and import that in after effect and adjust that color let's go to watching this tutorial Okay, first in Real Fellow, create a new project, for example, Honey 2. After that, in Geometry, create Plane and create Text, for example, VFXRZ. And now in a Standard Particle, click this circle. And here in a Scale, select that and change a scale for example here is good okay now change position top and left here very good now um, here click this circle particle and in position select here because I want to create animate from this particle um, and now change indicator to 200 and change it to here and after that click this circle and when you change this indicator as you can see it creates this animation okay now if you click simulate as you can see it's um, like liquid okay first if you want to create honey you should increase viscosity for example I want change it to 50 now click reset after that click simulate as you can see it's like honey but as you can see it's flying because here we should create gravity and um, change position for example to here and again click simulate now it's better and now for killed this particle you should um, add this cut speed and now click reset and again click simulate very good it's better now and here select this a plane and in sticky 
change sticky for example to um, I think two is good and uh, we don't bounce we don't need bounce and change it to zero and for friction change it to um, I think two is good now play that to see that result okay it's better now we should uh, select this text add in bounce again change it to zero add in particle friction change it to and sticky change it to okay click reset and simulate okay it's better you can increase this um, particle from, from this resolution for example change it to 2 and reset simulate okay it's better very good now click reset add in mesh tab click here and select particle mesh and check it under this particle mesh it is good now um, in export export central here um, turn off this checkbox and turn on mesh cache after that click done very good and now in tools select clean data folder and then click yes now click simulate and waiting for finish this simulating okay render is finished but um, oops I forget um, you should select this move option and then click plane and change this plane and select this plane and change it to here here is good and click reset and again click simulate and okay it's done and uh, now if you play that uh, first click this mesh and click this shade okay now when you play that as you can see it's like honey very good now open uh, 3ds max after that um, here um, select this option and here select real flow and in mesh loader select here after that here select this button and in for example honey tool in meshes select first mesh and then click open now as you can see it's create it's good and here very good now when you change that as you can see it's like this now we should open this text for open that uh, select this SD file import and then in scenes in honey tool click object and select text one and double click that as you can see it's open here 
now you should um, change rotation uh, select all this text and after that change rotation to here very good now select move and change here change it to here uh, I think if we change it to here is better I think here is good now change this move to here okay now when you change that we should change position to here now it's okay okay um, now change this to here and if you change it here it's better okay very good as you can see it's very good now for material open material and um, right click in material mental ray select arc and design if you can see this mental ray you should first in render setup here in render select this nvidia mental ray very good now uh, in material mental ray you should select arc and design after that it create this material and then you should double click um, and in transparency change it to 0 0.7 and change color to for example orange and change it to yellow after that you should right click here and in material in a standard click architectural and after that it create this menu and you should drag and drop this bitmap and double click here and in bitmap you should select your picture for example I select this picture and drag and drop this point for connect this to material after that you should Um, first in a standard click plane and create plane here change um, position to here very good now open this material and drag and drop this for background um, for this plane and change it to here and drag and drop this to your mesh and you can um, drag and drop this to your character this and this this and this very good after that here create uh, free direct and change position to here okay now change it to here and now if you click render production as you can see it's really it's good
now go to render setup and here select this range from 0 to 200 and here this size is good and here select this file and select a folder for example this folder is good and set a name we change it um, two is good and here you should select your type of um, your files for example tf is good and save okay now click render um, I think cancel that if we more zoom I think is better if you click render and yes here is better now you should waiting for this render okay it's done and now um, open after effect and um, create new composition after that in your file select your first tiff file sequence and then click import very good now drag and drop here and when you play that as you can see it's like honey okay now select your layer and in effect in color correction select levels and change these levels change to here and um, you can select utility and select HDR and change it to expand and adjust this color now it's better now when you play that as you can see it's like honey very good I will teach you how you can create professional honey and how you can real that honey very good thank you for watching this video and goodbye